Right, hey guys, it's Weston here. So today I'm going to be doing a comparison between the Huawei P9 and the Xiaomi Mi 5. And we're going to be looking at performance and speed. So in this video, I'm going to be taking a look at the specifications, the Antutu and Geekbench scores, and then most importantly, some real world testing to see which one of those performs quicker in real world situations. So anyway, let's not waste any more time and let's just get into it. Right, so let's take a quick look at specifications first. So the Xiaomi Mi 5 is packing a Snapdragon 820, which is a quad-core chip. It's got an Adreno 530 GPU, 3GB of RAM, and it's running Android 6.0. The Huawei P9 has a Kirin 955, which is an octa-core CPU. It's got a Mali T8800 MP4 GPU, 3GB of RAM, and it's also running Android 6.0. So let's look at the Geekbench and Antutu scores. So in Geekbench 4, the Xiaomi Mi 5 scored a single core score of 1662 and a multi of 3980. The Huawei P9 scored 1743 on the single core side and 5262 on the multi core. Uh, Antoine 2 2 next, and the Xiaomi Mi 5 scored 122,666 and the Huawei P9 scored 91,024. Now, as we all know, specs and these numbers don't mean everything, so let's take a look at a speed comparison now to see which one is actually quicker in real world performance. Right guys, so let's start off this comparison now. I'm just going to show you that both these phones have no apps open whatsoever. So anyway, let's get started. So first up, we're going to open YouTube to see which opens first. And you can see the Huawei P9 won that one and it actually opened up a little bit quicker. So Google Chrome next, and again, the Huawei P9 won this one. So let's try the Play Store next. And again, the Huawei P9 opened that one much quicker. Next up, let's try Twitter. See which one opens quicker there. And again, the Huawei P9 won that one by quite a significant margin this time. Next up, let's try Instagram. And again, the Huawei P9 is quicker. So let's try Google Plus next. A little bit closer this time, but again, the P9 did take it. So now let's try loading up the uh, Injustice Gods Among Us game to see which does this faster. So I'm actually going to speed this up because it does take a long time, and then I'll just uh, slow it down when they're about to load up. So you can see that even though both of these have got really good specifications for opening apps from fresh, the Huawei P9 is much quicker. Now they are really similarly specced, I mean the Huawei has an octa-core processor whereas the Mi 5 is a quad-core. But anyway, uh, what we're going to do now is start this app running and then we're going to start doing some multitasking in the sort of a real world scenario to see which one actually opens up and see what the RAM management is like as well. Right guys, so let's start opening some apps and see which one does it quickest. And you can see actually the Mi 5 was a little bit quicker opening up Google+. Plus. Let's try Instagram. And again, the Mi 5 was actually a little bit quicker. So let's try Twitter next. And again, the Mi 5 did seem to be slightly faster, just very slightly. So let's try Google Plus. I'd call that one a draw both. We're very quick on that one. So let's try Chrome. And again, the Mi 5 seemed to be a little bit quicker. So what I'm going to do now is open up a website and see which one can load a uh, article the quickest. ready and go and it seemed like to be neck and neck I think the P9 just slightly edged that one so anyway let's open this article and see which one does it first and actually both were really quick but I think the Mi 5 might have just taken it and finally let's go into YouTube and open up a video to see which one opens it up first so you can see the Mi 5 again was a little bit quicker Right, so let's open up a trending video to see which one of these can open and load the video the quickest. Right, so we'll pick this one here, so let's go. 
and actually they're pretty much neck and neck. I think the Huawei actually started playing a little bit quicker. But anyway, both did the task really quickly, but I think the edge did go to the P9. So there you have it guys, that was it for this uh, speed test comparison between these two phones. Right guys, so there you have it, you've seen all the results of this test. So you can see specs wise both are really really well specced, I mean we've got an octa core processor on the P9 and we've got a really good quad core on the Mi 5. GPUs, I would give the edge to the Mi 5, it seems to score better in Antutu which is kind of a more GPU intensive and it did score better there. The P9 did claw it back though and win Geekbench in both the single and multi and I'm presuming that's because of the octa core in comparison to the quad core. I'm not sure why that is actually. Both chips seem to be really really impressive and whichever you're going to get they're going to perform well. And we actually saw that in the speed test, even though the Huawei did actually win the first round in opening apps up from fresh, the Mi 5 did actually take the win in the second part, loading apps from memory. So I guess that's down to your preference, really. Do you have a lot of apps running in memory? Because if you do, then the Xiaomi might be a little bit quicker at opening those apps up. But if you're loading apps from fresh and you're clearing your memory, then the P9 does seem to perform better there. Right guys, so that is it. So I'm going to be reviewing the Huawei P9 very soon and also the Xiaomi in a couple of weeks. So if you want to see both those videos, then definitely hit that subscribe button because they're coming very soon. So thank you so much for watching guys. Any shares, comments, we really appreciate it. So thanks again guys and I will see you all on the very next video.